In this video I will talk a little bit about resolving mod conflicts as well as adding and removing mods. As you can see in here I have selected the Von Pyons mod and you can see that there are a couple mods highlighted. Mods highlighted with an orange highlight um, mean that these mods are getting overridden by the selected mod and mods highlighted with a red marker are mods that override the selected mod. It is also possible to open up the conflict window on the right where you can see an overview of all the mods that override or are overwritten by. Selecting the mods show you the exact files that the mod uh, overrides or is getting overwritten by. Now let's say you want to add a mod to your collection. You can do this through the application itself. I'm going to update the Von Biomes mod because I just downloaded the new version for Von Biomes. You could do this by just adding the mod and uh, the application will try to override all the files of the mod um, by itself. However, it is recommended to remove a mod before updating it, so no files linger around that could cause the uh, mod to not work properly. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to right click from biomes and I'm going to click on remove mod. I'm going to click yes. Now I need to uh, add a new mod. So I'm going to click on the add mod button. And I'm going to go to my downloads folder and I'm going to select Von Biomes and open. Some mods are very large. The Von Biomes mod is about 7 gigabytes, I think. So extracting this mod will take quite a while. Uh, you can see if a mod is still extracting at the notification at the top. So we're just going to have to wait until um, the mod has finished extracting. The duration of this depends on your computer, but large files like this can take quite a while. Alright, so now that the mod has finally extracted after about 30 seconds, I can see it in my mod list and I could just drag it where I want to put it, enable it and then deploy. <laughs> If you're not sure what mod should load after which other mod, don't be afraid to ask the mod author. At least if they're still active, they will uh, probably tell you uh, when a mod needs to load in what order. Or you could join a Discord like the yet another um, server, which uh, has a lot of active users that are eager to help you out with your load order issues.